study that I find absolutely fascinating. According to this new study, majority of Gen Z and millennials think that women's rights have gone too far and women are coming out on top in the supposed equality push. The Telegraph reports that 52% of Gen Z and 53% of millennials say society has gone so far in promoting women's rights that it is discriminating against men. That's according to a survey by Ipsos UK and the Global Institute for Women's Leadership at King's College London. Now, that opinion is only shared by 40% of baby boomers and 46% of Gen Xs. That is shocking to me because if you showed me this data, I would have sworn that it would be the baby boomers and the Gen X who would hold the position that actually millennials and Gen Z hold. It's really interesting. I think, you know, it's predictable probably that this moment would eventually come. I don't think it's come yet, but these surveys are signals that it's coming where the majority of the population thinks we've overcorrected yeah. for whatever the ostensible issue is that we're trying to correct for. And, um, you know, the segmentation is very interesting. So men, of course, feel that way because they're at the front of the firing line. Women do too. I think it's for two reasons. Women have men in our lives that we care about, brothers and sons and fathers, and we don't want to see them disadvantaged, which is increasingly happening. And I also think there's a short-term versus long-term issue where it may be helpful in the short term, but in the long run, I actually think it hurts women because everybody thinks you got to a position of leadership because it was a handout. Mm -hmm. But the boomer and uh, Gen, Gen Z millennial thing I think is really interesting. I think you know, it's a function of living in theory mm -hmm. where the boomers are versus in reality where the younger people see the results of these policies and um, it's probably undeniable now that it's hurting men uh, more yeah. than it's helping women. Well, I really hope this trend continues and this poll is in some sort of an outlier because that, well, that's why the Gen X figure surprises me, that that's not higher. We've got 46% of Gen Xs who say it's gone too far and men are being disadvantaged because a lot of those Gen Xs have... Uh, sons and, and they can see the impact on their sons. They can see the rhetoric in the schooling system, in the culture, from commercials to what you see out of uh, Hollywood. And it's just this relentlessly anti-male sentiment that seems to be normalised now. Absolutely. And Gen X usually is a sensible generation. Maybe That's I'm biased. That's what I say. Yeah, same here, <laughs> there. Um, so maybe, that, as you say, that trend needs to continue. I think schools is a big one. That's where you'll really see people, you know, the mama bears, as they say, come out. Uh, and then it, it just trickles up from there, I hope. But there's definitely an overcorrection that's happening. And um, hopefully we see more of this.